This slideshow describes how WWR was used to construct a highway barrier wall. The lower wall steel consists of two mats tied together. The wall trench foundation is excavated. The lower wall steel is lowered into the trench with a crane. The wall mat rests on block supports placed on the trench bottom. Notice the construction joint on the left. The trench concrete is placed and vibrated. The upper wall steel is placed and positioned for the slip forming. The upper wall is slip-formed. A few concluding comments on using WWR in this application. The rigidity of the cages helped in placing the steel and improved productivity. Two types of cages were used, one for the foundation and one for the wall. The cage was dropped into the trench and concrete placed. Tying rebars in the trench would have been difficult. The slip-forming went well with no waves in the wall. The slip forming industry has adapted their equipment for WWR cages. Contractors say that slip forming goes four to five times faster with WWR.